What's going on, Lego fans? Nick Straight Up Bricks here with part two of a 100-pound Lego haul. I got close to 100 pounds, definitely 80, 90, possibly 100 pounds of free Lego from Facebook. There's a buy-nothing group in my area. I went to get the Lego. This is actually the bin that they were gonna give me. They had three bins. I asked, hey, could I buy the other two? They said, no, we, you know, we'll give them to you. The first video is up. That video is of the bin that had the least amount of Lego in it. It was like halfway, three fourths of the way filled. I put that video up. There's some cool pieces in it. You know, it's not my best, but it is a good video. You can definitely check it out. This is part two. I don't know if I'm gonna split this in half and, you know, do two videos with this. But like I said, this is the bin they were gonna give me. This bin, I can't wait to look in to see what I get. The next one, I don't know if it's gonna be part four and five or part three, whatever, but I can't wait to check that one out because I saw the top of it and I saw so many cool pieces and I can't wait to you know, go through and look through it and be surprised with all you guys. So right now we're gonna be doing this bin here. Again, I don't know if I'm gonna do you know half now and then half later but i'm gonna dump this out and i'm gonna see what treasures are hidden underneath here and i'd like to genuinely be surprised just like you guys to see what's in this container so let's get into it um right away some airport stickers which makes sense because this is a airplane piece right here i got some stickers i'm just gonna put that to the side uh, get some stuff out of the way there's an Ninjago card. That's kind of cool. Two uh, base plate kind of dealies. And also I'm going to have some uh, music in the background as well. So have something to listen to while I sort through. And let's dump half of this into a long clear container. As opposed to what I did last time, which was just uh, go through the bin and make a bunch of noise and not get to see what was on the bottom. I'm gonna do it the right way this time. We got an airplane. Pretty well put together too. Looks kind of complete. Another one, very similar to the one I just showed you. That looks complete. We got a bag, an unopened bag, which is another airplane. Somebody was in the airplanes. Okay. Move some of this big stuff out of the way. We have a yellow, that's the second or third one of these I have. A yellow base plate. If we find any marbles, we get to put them in the House of Marble bag. I'm not sure what this thing is. It looks like a pool toy. Something you throw. I don't know what the heck that is. Ah, uh, we have here. I don't know if you guys have seen my shorts, but um, I, I accidentally left one of these outside and it got melted and warped. So it's good to have another one of these. We have one of these globe, half globe pieces. These are always cool. People make cool mocks out of them. We got a trash can, recycle bin, tech deck. That's an alien workshop tech deck. Weird piece. Okay. Um, Keychain. There's an airplane airborne piece. All right, so I just grab a couple things right here. First minifigure, uh oh, first minifigure piece is 
a dude with a, uh, um, like a, a surfer, a sailboat torso. And then it's funny because this isn't a Lego piece right here, but they are making this piece right here into a Lego piece for the new Mario Kart sets. I, I think I saw that. And then we have this strange fella here. All right, we have our first Ninjago piece. It's a ninja head. It's, I believe this is Lloyd's Golden Dragon head. It's a good piece. We've got a duck. This doesn't look to be a Lego piece. It looks like a Transformer, Hasbro, Hasbro. But you could put, definitely put that on a minifigure. That would look pretty cool. Make some kind of weird mock thingy with that. All right, we got a double-headed... Oh, all right. That looks... That's the Stone Warrior. And then we got a head. I bet you we find one of those red hats. They're always in these bins. So that would make that Stone Ninja complete. Finally, we're finding some Minecraft figures. He's not even complete. It's just the torso. So many Minecraft sets. It's junk. McDonald's toy, McDonald's toy thing. Ah, oh, here we go. First animal. Got a little Dugans. He's a good boy. There's a droid. That is the droid I'm looking for. We got, uh, I love this piece from Galaxy Squad. One of the bugs. And then we have that that looks like um, what is that? That looks like a like a kilt from maybe the CMF guy, bagpipe player, and then Lloyd's or Ninja torso. <laughs> got to be a bowling pin, of course. We got a Star Wars hat. Looks like a cop head on a banker's body. We can just put that together like that. Those pants look familiar. Hmm. I think we're going to be finding a lot of uh, green pieces because that uh, Toy Story. I saw a lot of the pieces from the Toy Story guys, the army men. So we might be finding a lot of uh, those pieces. That is a Star Wars piece, but that's Hasbro. Fancy. Got a little skateboard. I don't know if that's that. I don't think that's a. That's oh. Uh, it looks like I don't know what kind of legs they are. They got a design on them. They look pretty cool. Okay. We got a skeleton arm and leg. You could say, uh, you could say I didn't pay an arm and leg for this. <laughs> and we got a droid body. A trident. Uh, it looks like a trooper with a jail, uh, prisoner. And that weird head. A city head. I'm 
some more green. Told you. We got a car. Looks like a um, Galaxy Squad body torso with the aqua paint head and legs, possibly. That looks like Luigi, but that's not Lego. As I said, green, green legs. Got some, some short legs. Oh man, it looks like someone drew on the middle in the middle of that. It just doesn't look like it. Maybe that'll come off easy. Hopefully. White legs. thinking that's a cars piece but it don't look like Lego I'll keep it just in case that looks like a, a Pirates of the Caribbean legs maybe Jack Sparrow or it could be it could be um, Ninjago I'm not sure there's a regular head. Helmet. Alright, so we got We got that head there with a pirate torso and an Atlantis shark legs. That is it's a Darth Vader helmet. That's pretty solid, but I'm not seeing, I'm not seeing Lego on the inside. I think that's Lego. I'll have to check that out. We got two heads. Two heads are better than one. Got a little guy. Nice. We have an NBA player and he's got number five and he's got the legs that make him shoot. That's cool. And that looks like a pretty cool piece right there. That looks cool.
some non-Lego pieces with a torso. I believe that's Han Solo. Could be wrong. And that's an Ender Tower from Minecraft, right? We got a Dark Frog. Uh, Transformer. He's pretty solid. He's metal. Bounce a ball. Brown slide. That's got to be two of a particular set. We have some Lego dice. Sweet. Little car. Alright, we got a Star Wars Mandalorian, right? I'm gonna have a nice little handful of stuff here. We have a giant marble. We can put our marble bag. This looks like. I think that's Lego. That's a Gal Galaxy Squad helmet. We have a cool skateboarder with a helmet. Just like I said, the Green Army Man from Toy Story. Got a racer and then one of my favorite pieces the shark head from Atlantis that's cool because it I found the legs now I just gotta find the torso part of that Shoulder pads. El Toro Loco. Yeah, I keep seeing this, so I'm just going to tell you guys. This is from a set. I'm not sure if it's Aqua Raiders or an old set, but it's too... What, like um, a da an anglerfish, danglerfish, whatever that fish is, that has the light. I think this is the eye part. I just I kept seeing it. I had to point it out. We got some legs and a head. Ah, we got. Ninjago head, headphones, and then we have Power Miner Rock Monster, but he's missing his head. Um, Star Wars Battle Droid, but it's like a little statue of him. We got two pairs of pants. cars and a die. Pretty awesome bionicle piece. Okay, that looks like a, a dinos, dino hunter. Um, the dinosaur sets. That's a dino hunter torso. That's what I'm trying to say. Pants with a what looks like a fake Lego head. I'm not sure if that's real. Ah, uh, there it is. Finally, of course he doesn't have any arms. All right. Let's see if we can put them together. There you go. Find enough parts. We'll have a. Uh, a full figure. <clears throat> oh, nice. Two, wait a minute. Three pieces, a three piece right here. Let me show you. We got Star Wars torso, Harry Potter torso, and then the best torso ever, SpongeBob. 
But it's it's uh, SpongeBob and he's a superhero. What, what's that? What's his name? And I thought we found little blue legs, didn't we? Didn't we just find blue? There's the other one. Nice, sweet SpongeBob. That is a good one. There's another one of those statues, but he's missing his body. We have a ninja. And he's holding up number one. Is he saying first? Is that Ninja 999 right there? Saying he's first? Is that you, Ninja 999? Huh? Number one? You're first? Is that how you keep being the first one? You're already in the bin? Ninja 999? Got a skateboard. Atlantis, Torso. That's, um, <laughs> that is not a Lego head, but it is a Lego body and legs. That's a kind of, that's, that's a cool torso. I wonder what that's from. Maybe Indiana Jones or something? Wonder what that's from. I'm gonna check that out. I just saw legs. They, they look cool too. Where the heck did that just go? They look like Chima legs. Where did you disappear to? Oh, you have the SpongeBob piece. There you go. Oh, whatever. Once you stop looking for it, that's when you find it. Ah, nice. Um, I think that's the Mexican CMF guy. Two legs. Some blue pants. We have either old Santa Claus or Dumbledore's. Or Sensei Wu. Weird. Right? Oh! That's a good one. Patrick. That's a good one. I didn't know that piece came off like that. That is a tiny SpongeBob piece. There's some more light. Um, pants that actually have something, something on them, a tracker on them. Got a helmet. That's not Lego. That's kind of cool. Oh, nice. Little dinosaur. Little Dugans.
might be a Indiana Jones set in here after all. Staring at my arm. Got a minor hat. Some white pants. Those legs, I knew I, I knew I saw them. I knew it. Those are Chima alligator legs. See you later, alligator. And real quick, this is what the eye looks like. You put that piece on there like that. Okay, we got a Ninjago skeleton torso. Telly. I think that's that fish that I was talking about. Big old thing piece. That was a cool piece. But it's fake. Helmet. Okay, uh, there we go. There's something. There's a pirate. Some uh, dark blue legs. Somewhere, I think that's from that fish. Huevos.
fake. I do love these these colored pieces. It's a little dinged up though. Helmet. It's not Lego. That, I think that's from Ninjago, but doesn't uh, Deadpool use this? This goes on Deadpool's back, right? He puts the swords in. It might be a, a piece for uh, for. A, Deadpool figure. Or I could use it. Even if it's his back shoulder, uh, sword holders, buying a Deadpool piece is definitely fantastic. Ooh. Is that... That looks like, um... An old uh, explorer set torso. It's funny finding all these old figures and old sets. I can't wait till like the kids now, all the fig stuff they buy now is gonna be in loose Lego later. to that fish. That's pretty cool. Let me, uh, let me get something to drink and pour this into a container and get started on the next video. See you at part three.